Okay, this is part one of uh, putting the 6x6 six six pole in for the uh, Kilo Tracker kit. This is again my little stick that I use. I don't know if you can see that, but it's pointing dead south. And then I use a piece of uh, PVC pipe because it's non magnetic, basically to give me a, a guide that's easy to follow when I'm putting my stick in. And I'm going to put it right here close to the first tracker. I'm going to cut that 4x6 down and just leave all those connections that are there. Then I'm going to put one here down by my feet. Then I'm going to back up about 20 feet and put another, another set of poles in close to that stump. Okay, I'm going to do a time lapse of this now. We're actually putting it in and see how long it takes. That's it. Okay, just put my pole in. My little handy dandy. Aluminum stick with a level attached to it. Dug the hole, adjusted it. I put roughly uh, about 120 inches of uh, number four copper wire a foot down into the ground, longer than the pole. So the ground looks quite nice, and I have a lot of it, so that's what I used. And this stick is also good for uh, see how good a job you did on your pole. To move the bit. Oh well, that's where it's going to be now. That's not too bad. I can move with that. More importantly, so you take this aluminum stick, put it level on your beam, and you can come over here. Read down. I don't know if you can see that. Camera away from it. There it is, pretty much dead south. So it works real well. Put them in right the first time. Okay, that's it. I've had enough of this. I'm going to go back inside and weld up some more metal. Okay, that's it. That's the pole installed.